guys, welcome to another Disney vlog. So this is my run Disney trip. So I'm wearing no makeup, so I do apologise. So I am just outside the events arena where I'm going to go pick up my bibs. I think the 5k is starting soon, so there is a possibility I've got mind clash with me. But um, So I've got some new equipment, I've got a hand grip, and um, I'm going to be switching between my phone, because this is a new phone, I want to see what the quality is like, um, and the audio and everything like that, and also switching over to my dad's uh, camera. So sorry if the vlog's going to be very like jumpy or like quality and things like that, the sizes may be wrong. I'm going to do a lot of experimenting, but so yeah, I want to take you guys around the expo, see what it's like, um, and then yeah, I'm just gonna get my bib, go get some food, and then head straight back, head to my hotel, because I am exhausted. So yeah, let's get started. So I, I'm a bit lost. Um, what I thought was check-in, they pushed me the wrong way. So I've just come to the shop. So this, by the look of it, is the, the expo store. So back what you can buy um, plushies, toys, merchandise, all like, things like that. These are pretty cool. I saw these recently on somebody's vlog. I kind of like them, like they're cool. I think I'm gonna probably come back to this tomorrow because I don't know what I want, when I want it. So but all I wanna do is just get my, it's just to register, but I don't know where to do that. I think I'm just gonna to have to keep walking around until I find something but this place is huge it's massive and there's so many people so yeah it's kind of cool that looks like exchange over there toilets there's a lot of people in some really cool costumes that I've seen like some really good Disney bounds um so yeah all this girl walking in and everything, the signs and everything. So, yeah, all I want to do is. Uh, oh, yeah, there's also this giant wall that has everybody's name on it. So, I want to try and see if I can find my name. Uh, so, I think this is everybody that is participating in uh, Run Disney. So, yeah, still don't know where I'm meant to be going or what I'm doing, but uh, I'll figure it out, I think. It looks like there's some photo opportunities challenges mm. then the name wall I could be anywhere on here this is ridiculous oh well, at least it's done by first so I'm probably gonna have to like come back to this in a minute so yeah oh, more merchandise here spectator stuff so if you come with some friends or family and they don't want to do run disney they can um watch in certain areas and i believe for the 10k it's on main street and then obviously in the disney village i don't know if they have to pay or anything so sorry about that but uh yeah some more awesome costumes i really hope this quality is pretty good for you guys so i say this is my phone and i'm using a dongle thing some photo opportunities up here I don't know how much I'm going to be doing, like, thinking about, oh, here are the medals. So when you participate in a Run Disney event, you get a medal at the end, and then these are all the different medals. And then there's some over here as well. looks like past ones and also probably the ones that they have in a Walt Disney World as well they do them over there so yeah that is just kind of a brief uh, overhaul of this place I still don't know what I'm meant to be doing or where I'm meant to be going so I think I'm going to put you guys down and uh, have a look around without you know having the uh, you guys uh, disturbing you guys or anything like that so yeah okay so I've got my bearings so down there is where I came in slash that's where the um all, all that I was just showing you guys the store and all down and around they have different numbers for different stalls so these are the 10k stalls numbers going from 30,000 to 35,000 uh, mine was like 32,000 so I just went into the one there 
Then you've got 21 here, 36 over there, and I'm guessing five. Oh, five around the corner, but like say. And then they give you this bag, which has all your details in. And then I just then need to go get my t-shirt from this one because I'm female, 10K, and I picked an extra small to medium. I think I picked a medium, so it may be too big, but if not, I'll just use it as a night shirt. So I'm now gonna pick up my, um, my t-shirt and then have another look around and head out. So I just had to, just had a look for my name and I can't find my name. It goes from like LAU and then no LAURAs. It just goes like LAU something or LA something and then it just goes to like Lauren maybe. But once, I think when it's a little bit less busy, I'm gonna come back tomorrow um, and have a look. But yeah, I'll, sh I'll show you guys. It's, it's weird. It says, like Laurent, Laurenson, and then when I was going backwards, because I was like, well, L A U R B, obviously it's this way, but it's not. There is a Laura something somewhere, but not me. So I'm a little. Take it, it's showing me. I'm there. Why don't you do it? <laughs> Benefit of the doubt, it's surname then first name. But I found myself. Yay! I'm like third one along. And then like pretty much like eyesight, which is not too bad. Hey guys, so as you can tell, I am in my hotel room. I am exhausted. So it's been a very long day. So as you guys saw when I was at the expo, I was able to get my bib and everything. This is the bib where it is. It's so pretty. It's got three princesses on it. I thought it was just going to be just Rapunzel, but then they've put Jasmine and Pocahontas on it, which is interesting. Um, I wonder if Pocahontas will be out. Either way, so as you can see, I'm in Coral D, which I'm not very happy about. I was hoping to be in an earlier one, um, preferably like B or C, because I'm just worried that I'm not going to do it in time. But I think I know I'm going to whenever I have done my training. Not actually run full 10k gonna be out honest gonna be out there um i've run about five and a half and then either i had to stop because i was running out of time i had to stop for because uh, i was just too hot because every time i feel like i've done running in the past few weeks uh, months is either been um the only opportunities i've had is hot because <laughs> it's either been raining stupidly boiling or hot so in the morning hopefully it's going to be a lot cooler but either way it is what it is so i think it's about quarter past eight i've just finished my dinner and everything i'm uh, charging my phone up um i'm still on my phone by the way i probably will venture to my dad's camera once i'm actually in disney park i don't know how i'm going to do the vlogs this may be the start of the run disney vlog um and then i'll probably do like day one in the parks day two in the parks because i'm only in the parks tomorrow saturday and uh, tomorrow which is saturday and then sunday i may go in the parks monday morning i'm gonna see how i feel how my feet are and how i genuinely am i might just need to have a lion um and then just go straight to disney village and have a look around there because i leave at about one o'clock well no my my eurostar leaves at half one i think or no it's actually one uh, 1313 yeah the one on the way in was 1331 but on the way out it's 1313 so ooh, spooky so um yeah so i'm gonna charge my phone up for a bit i'm just gonna have a bath relax and then hopefully go to bed super early i want to try and fall asleep before 10 o'clock probably not going to happen um because I want to try and get a decent good night's sleep because I'm going to set my alarm for five o'clock in the morning. And as soon as I get up at five, jump in the shower, get myself dressed, have some breakfast. I've got those porridge pots that you can get that you just fill with water and then have that. Or if not, have a couple of brunch bars. Um, I realise I didn't bring any like biscuits or anything like that, but I have a couple of brunch bars. Have some um, Lucas Aid Sport to get some energy in me and then head straight off to run Disney in the morning from six o'clock. I was trying to aim to get for six, but because my coral is D, I might not actually be starting to run until like an hour and 20 minutes later. And I don't really want to be hanging around too much. But also at the same time, I don't want to get too late and then be at the back of my coral corral. I, can, I don't even know what the word is. It's 
yeah either way so yeah it's been a very exhausting day i didn't really do much after i spoke to you guys at the expo like i said i got my t-shirt i'll show you guys the t-shirt i don't like that it's green i'm just gonna put it over my face just because so you guys can see hopefully you can see that because i can't see <laughs> either way so i'm just I'm, because i'm holding you guys up and, and everything so da, da, da. yeah i wish it was purple because then obviously it would match, but it's not too bad. It's this weird fabric. So it's not like, I thought it was going to be a cotton t-shirt, but no, it's this weird fabric. And then there's like loads of logos and stuff on the back. So not necessarily something I may be wearing on an everyday basis. Um, I may not even wear it. I might, it might be a bed thing, but because of the texture, it's really weird. It's really weird. Anyway, so I'm going to go have a bath, relax, just get myself basically ready. So in the morning, I'm not running around like a, chicken a headless chicken going or wherever put everything i'm going to make sure that i have all my clothes ready to be laid you know to sort it out i'm going to make sure to pin everything on today so i'm not doing it when i'm really tired in the morning make sure that i've got pretty much everything laid out set perfectly and then head out i probably i'm not going to really i was tempted to get there for six but i think i might actually leave here at six because i'm at high park i'm back at high park for the first time in ages because i have been staying at um Kiriad, which is now a different name and high park has actually now been bought out by adashio no wonder it's suddenly so expensive high park used to be ridiculously cheap and then suddenly it's gone up in price but it's still pretty average so yeah, i'm back at lovely high park but they've got i don't know if it's just a special if i'm in a special room uh but this is a as you can see it's a bed it's not a the pull out uh, sofas which will hopefully be a lot better this is still here though you can tell you're at Hyde Park when this creepy hemlock stone happening, whatever this this is. I don't even know what this is, but every time I see it at Hyde Park, I'm like, oh, I'm back at home at Hyde Park and the bathroom's still amazing. But yeah, so I'm at Hyde Park, so I am just five minutes around the corner, ten minutes around the corner. Um, I don't think they have any special buses in the morning, so I'm going to have to walk from here there, which is not too bad because it will be a good warm-up, but I am concerned about walking that strip. Um, but hopefully there may be other people staying here that will also be doing run disney in the morning so uh, but i'll just have to keep an eye out and be very wary of uh, my surroundings it's because it's going to be five o'clock in the morning it's going to be six o'clock in the morning so it's going to be dark either way so yeah i'm going to say uh, good night to you guys and everything so i'm going to take you on this journey with me i'm going to be taking you on run disney um i'm going to be using my phone for the majority of the footage because i don't want to break my dad's camera he says it doesn't matter, but I don't want to break my dad's camera. And also it's less to carry. So all I'm going to be taking tomorrow is my phone, put my key card in the back of my phone, pray that it doesn't dodge up the the um, the connection sort of thing. But um, And then also take my hand grip, which is that a brown foot? Actually, I think it's in this bag. I can show you guys. So yeah, I bought this from Amazon for about £15. So you just hold it here. It's got a wrist strap and then... That looks a bit scary but you just essentially slot your phone in here um, and then you just twiddle the dial at the top and then you can hold it so I can hold it to film myself like this um, or I can then obviously like what I did for the the expo I can um, film better so I'm taking that because that it's 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 light it's super you know it's not gonna I, I hope it's not gonna cause any issues because it's not an extension this is this so and it should slot in the pocket that I have um in my trousers or if not I can put it back here if need be because they do give you a clear bag um because they don't actually go through security with you. They have to just quickly look at the bags and then you just put your bags down. But for, again, security, they don't, they recommend to have no valuables or anything. So I'm not actually going to even take this bag with me. It's literally just going to be my phone, my key card, and then my hand grip, because that's pretty much all I need. Because as soon as I'm done there, I'm coming back here to shower and have a rest and then get myself ready for the day. I don't know what time I'm going to be getting for Disney in the morning because one, it depends on the time I finish the run. Two, it depends on what time I actually get back here, how long I want to sleep. So I'm probably thinking it's going to be like maybe 11, 12 o'clock, but I've got the whole day um, to do everything I want to do. I've then got the whole of Sunday, like I said, so I'm going to try and get as much of the Lion King stuff done because I really am looking forward to that and the jungle book jive um and everything so yeah i hope having this camera grip is going to make things a little bit more steadier a little bit more sturdier 
in the vlogging. I don't know how much difference it's going to make tomorrow on the run Disney, so it might be a bit excuse me, might be a bit jerky, might be a bit wobbly um things, but I'm probably not gonna vlog when I'm jogging. It's only when I'm gonna stop and do a walk and it may only be like, you know, yeah, you finally reached the first mile the first mile, the first kilometer, and then, you know, oh here's a character sort of thing. So, you know, I've already practiced running with a water bottle, so I know what it's like to have something in my hand. So it's not going to cause too much problems. So, yeah, so the next footage of, will be of you guys, for you guys, will be me looking a bit better than this. Because I'm going to be wearing makeup tomorrow. I actually look, don't, I don't, don't look too bad, actually. I just look very tired, which I am. Um, I'm putting a bit of makeup on tomorrow because whenever I've done a run and I've come home and I've looked at myself in the mirror, red as a beetroot don't want that especially if I might see some characters that I'm gonna hopefully meet um but it's weird because even though obviously they have the, the the opportunity for characters and they have obviously these photo locations and they have the the, the pop-up things that say one two five whatever k I'm not too bothered about that I just want to do it just to say I've done it and everything like if there's non-rare characters I'm not going to go for them I only really want to go for some rare characters I'm expecting long queues and wait times so that might add things you know add on to the time but I just want to make sure I do it and I don't get you know in you know there's gonna be no problems I'm not gonna hurt myself I just want to do it but doing the 5k even a few weeks ago because I didn't run last weekend because I wasn't um because I had some personal issues but the last time I did do that fi uh, 5k I was okay I was actually not too bad so but I've been running on my own I've been running in hot weather so I think being in the cool morning surrounded by people being in the Disney atmosphere they'll go by like that but even when I look at the map I'm like that's 1k I could, I could walk that in like three seconds sort of thing. So either way, I've been blabbering on for 10 minutes. So I do apologise. Um, but you guys know what it's like if you've been watching me for ages. So yeah, next footage will be bright and early morning run Disney 10k.